I'm Dr. David Hill, and today we're going to be talking about infant acne cure. Now, how do infants get acne? What, isn't that a teenage disease? Well, very interesting. Infants frequently get acne, and they get it for the same reason that teenagers get it. They're exposed to a lot of hormones. Where do these hormones come from? They come from the womb. They are present in the mother's bloodstream, and they're absorbed into the baby's bloodstream through the placenta. Newborn babies will have a lot of hormonal effects. Male babies will have large, dark scrota that will eventually shrink up into a more juvenile appearance. Female babies may have a lot of vaginal discharge. They may even have a little period four or five days after they're born. That can be very alarming to parents, but it's very common. You'll also see the sort of pustules or little whiteheads or blackheads, comedones, that are typical of acne, often in the first several weeks of life. So, is there a cure? You're going to put them on Strivectin or Retin-A? No, we don't use those things on infants. Not so good. There are some data to suggest that an antifungal cream called ketoconazole can be helpful, and we've had a lot of success using ketoconazole in infants. Now, the best cure for infant acne is time. It's going to go away. Why? Because those hormones are going to wash out. The hormonal effects will go away, and the infant's probably got about 12 to 14 years before he or she has to worry about acne again. Talking about acne in infants and how to cure it, I'm Dr. David Hill.